Hey everyone, welcome back to the Spice tutorial series. I'm Ryan Harris. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to add music, voiceovers, and sound effects to your videos. And I can't stress this enough, but sound is so important to your videos. It's worth learning how to add and create better sound effects, sound design, voiceovers, and adding better music to your videos to make them more engaging. So we're gonna hop into the Splice app and I'm gonna show you guys how to do this. So I've got some footage from a trip to Hawaii loaded up in my Splice timeline here. And I'm gonna start off by adding some music to liven these shots up and make it a bit more of a story. So we're gonna click the music button in the bottom bar and open up the music. You can add music from your iTunes or imported music from your files folder or you can simply just use the music that's included with the Splice app, which is all of this right here. I'm gonna use music that's included in the app today, so I'm gonna click cinematic, and I want something kind of calming for this video. I'm gonna try this ocean meditation. Listen to a few different songs and find one you like, and once you like it, simply tap add. The song will load into your timeline and you can move it around just like you would with a video clip by holding down and dragging it. I'm gonna start it right here at the start. And to control the different settings of the audio, you can click the audio and you'll see below you have volume settings and you can change the volume of the song. You can also make it fade in and out with these two buttons on the right side of the volume. When they're blue, it means it'll fade in or it will fade out. So I'm gonna leave the volume at 100, and I'm gonna see how this looks with my clips so far. So I'll play the video. Perfect, I like the mood of this song so far. I think it matches what I'm going for for this footage, kind of a bit of a mysterious and epic sound to it. And now I'm gonna to want to add sound effects so I'm gonna go and click the sounds button here. Already loaded into Splice, you have all these awesome sound effects that you can use in your video, which is amazing. I know that first clip is a forest shot, so I'm gonna go down and find a forest sound effect right here, and I'm gonna click add. Once that sound effect is in, you edit it in the same way you'd edit a video. So I want it to start in the middle, so I'm gonna drag this left bar right to where I see the audio waves go a little higher. And now I can move it to the start by holding down and dragging it all the way to the start here. And I will also trim it, grab this right line, drag it all the way back, and I'll let it fade into the next clip a little bit also. I'm gonna click on that sound effect and go to volume, and I'm gonna make it fade out by clicking this button right here on the right. And now we should have a good sound effect of the forest. Let's take a look. Perfect. Already you can see it adds a lot to our video. And for these next clips, I'm going to want a bit of a wind sound effect. So I'll go back to the sounds button, ambient, and I'm going to look for a wind. Here we go. I'll click the wind one, and that sounds perfect. So I'll click add. And once again, I can trim it however I want. I'll have it start here, and I'm gonna move the entire sound effect to just the start of this clip right there. And I'll trim it down right to the end of the clip, right about, I'll have it run into this clip as well. And then again, we'll go to volume, and I want it, this sound effect to fade in and fade out. I think it's nice to not have your sound effects come on or turn off or turn on too quickly, so let's listen to this now. Perfect. So already we're getting a nice mood with these sound effects that we're adding. If at any time you want to change the volume of a sound effect, go into this volume button again and you can lower the sound of the wind or whatever, whatever sound effect you're using. I'm going to leave it at 100 because I think it sounds really good. And another example here, we've got some waves coming over the rocks. So I'll go back to my sound button and I'll go ambient and I'll look for a wave, wave sound effect. I'll add that and we will drag it. I want it to start right out there. We'll have it come in maybe right before that shot here. 
and I'll trim it to the end of the ocean shots. Perfect, and we'll go into volume again, fade in, fade out. I'll leave it at 100, and let's take a look at how that sounds. So I was a little off on the timing. I'm gonna drag this one a little farther down. Here, we'll want it to come in right around there. Perfect, let's try again. That's perfect. So there are endless sound effects in here that you can add to your videos, all the different sound effects, and the more sound effects that you layer on top of your video, assuming you're doing a good job of it, it will just make it more and more ambient and give your video even more of a style and a mood. So make sure to pay attention to sound effects when you're using the Splice app. You can also easily add a voiceover to your video by scrolling along the bottom bar, click the voice button, you'll see a three, two, one countdown. And now my voiceover is recording over my video. And when I'm done, I'll press stop. Now my voiceover is done. I can drag it around like I would with any audio or video clip. And I can also change the volume of it and have it fade in or fade out if I choose to. That's it for this episode on adding sounds to your videos in the Splice app. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please let us know in the comments below if you guys enjoyed this tutorial and found it useful or any other tutorials that you'd like to see moving forward. Thank you so much for your time and I'll see you in the next video.